Hello, everyone, and welcome to E2E. Yep, that's right. Enigmatica 2 Expert Edition. We are finally playing. And as you can see, we've got a death worm in the water. Off to a fantastic start. Okay, basically, just started the server. Got a couple of friends on here, Potato Master and Rolly. They're, they're off. Looks like Rolly's just punching a tree right now. That's pretty good. Anyway, let's play. Now, I have no idea how to do anything here. I know a couple of the mods, but I don't know all of them. So it's going to be a, kind of a journey couple things I want to accomplish in this series. First one, I want to beat it. Beat the mod pack. Which I believe means collecting everything here. Another thing I want to do is I want to build a giant city with my base in it. Yep, that's right. We're building an entire city. Now there's building tools here. So hopefully it shouldn't be like a nightmare scenario where I have to place every block by hand. But I think I can build a city, you know. And finally, third point, have a good time. Have good memes. You know, make good video. Sounds good. All right, let's go. I'm trying to kill a sandworm. You're going to kill a sandworm off the rip? I don't even know what I'm doing yet, bro. <laughs> check the checkbox to get your starter kit. So this one? Oh, and then you just claim. Oh, nice. Okay, so that's how you claim stuff. Okay, I have a full I have a full set of armor. Let's go. Dude, I'm, I'm going into the desert, man. What's the worst that could happen? Oh, we got, a, we got a purple slime island over there, by the way. I ran into a bit of a problem i ran into a bit of a very good for me i just got a uh, dragon uh, skeleton and i got 20 bones and a skull so we're off to a great start what really <laughs> yeah <laughs> let's go mechanism cables tend hey. to cause lag try not to overuse them really next task scanner okay so basically it's telling me to build a scanner bro i can't build that are you crazy okay well that's that'll have to wait so i guess now we work on tools right oh it's Two planks per craft? Ugh. Oh, God. Bad, 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 bad. What'd you do? Oh, there's a couple baby zombies outside. <laughs> oh, God. Oh. <laughs> All right. Next quest. Your first pickaxe. You need to use the part builder and make stuff. I can do this. I know what I'm doing. Bam, baby. Wooden pickaxe. Let's go. Okay, now the real question is, can I make a dragon bone one? Oh, I can. <laughs> Bro, skipping half the game. I right? am skipping half the game, but because I found a dragon in the desert. <laughs> yeah, baby. <laughs> Let's go. Am I gonna follow this quest, or am I gonna do other things? Well, you know what? Let's just get a smell tree today. That seems like a good idea. Hang on a minute. So I got a loot box from one of my quests, right? Okay. And I opened it. All right, and it said legendary, so that that's that means I'm lucky, right? Well, anyway, I got an angel ring. I'm fairly certain this is extremely overpowered. Bruh. I don't think I can use it, though. I think it's only active in beacon range. But I have an angel ring now, so I'm probably very lucky. Okay, so next up, I need a clay bucket. Okay, so I got the clay bucket. Yay. Oh, now we need to make the entire Tinker's Contract smeltery? Jesus. Okay. Yes, we have one player sleep. Let's go, dude. All right, I'll take this bed with me then. Guys, I found Order Crystal from Thomcraft. That's probably useful. I found Charged Certus Quartz as well. Get me out of this cave. I need to make some torches. Ow, fuck, fuck. Let go of me. Let go of me. Let's go you. Ow, ow, ow. What? Hey. Over Ooh, here. copper. Okay, let's grab that. Let's grab some Certus Quartz. This is important, probably. I saw that. Whitening? Does anyone happen to know what the uh, effect whitening is? Do you feel superior? Now, hang on <laughs> just a second. Whoa. <laughs> okay, um, uh, I may or may not have just held down the Vein Miner button while looking at stone. Oh. I am now starving to death. Is that a cave troll? I'm leaving. Oh, no, I need to make the smell tree. Maybe I should do that. Oh, so it, it's sand, gravel, and clay. Okay, four stacks of grout. I'm going to make four furnaces. Smell tree controller. Seared tank. Okay, seared drain. Casting table. Smell tree quest complete. I got a loot chest. Quest. I got harvest level three completed. Brother. And harvest level... F Whoa! Fellas, the chest crafting recipe... 
I don't like it. Wait, I have enough. I have enough to upgrade my smeltery to too tall, so that means I won't accidentally fall in it. Let's go. I think we can start making some metals now. So what do we need? Do we want to make? Hold on. Mining level. Mining level is a thing. Let me go look. I don't have a lot of lead though. Oh, silver has this. I have a lot of silver. You know what's crazy? I just said that I don't have a lot of lead, and then I mined two blocks in my mine, and I found lead and silver right next to each other. Okay, so now we make a clay cast. Bam. And now we pour silver in it. And now we have a silver pickaxe head. Very nice. Molten clay onto the things. And then we pour silver in the cast. And now we can make a pickaxe. 430 durability, mining speed of 5. Mining level lead. That's pretty good. 8 osmium? Oh, dude, that's enough to make the next pickaxe. Man, I'm gonna have to bend in the silver right after I made it. Oh, I'm rich. Oh, I'm rich. Diamonds! Gold, finally. Oh, I can make casts, finally, dude. I can make actual good pickaxes now. All right, here's all the stuff I got. That's pretty good. Got some gold. I'm actually going to make some casts now. Okay, I need an ingot. I'm going to sacrifice one of these iron ingots to make an ingot mold. Is this a bad idea? Probably. But, fellas, silver and gold does, in fact, make an alloy, as I now have electrum. Whoops. I'm just going to have to take the electrum out of the furnace because I have no idea what to do with it. I'm just going to make it into ingots and then remelt it later. So next up, I need to get an obsidian sharpening kit, which I would assume you need to melt obsidian. Okay, so basically we need to mine obsidian. I would assume that an osmium pickaxe would be able to do that. So I guess that is my next tool. Yeah, there we go. Osmium pickaxe. Okay, another thing is we're going down to get obsidian, right? And we're also running out of lava here. So I think I need to make a bucket. And unfortunately, uh, we can't make a bucket with ingots we need the plates so we need to make a hammer which we need iron for so okay got the hammer done now we just need to make the actual iron plates hopefully i actually made enough iron to do this One, two three boom boom and boom we got a bucket nice i'm struggling to find sir discords oh 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 uh, uh oh i'm starving to death oh and here we have our obsidian sharpening kit quest completed i'm taking the fire resistance potion because i bet it's going to have me going to the nether next yep cobalt well what's the worst that could happen You know what? I fully ex I fully expected to die when I came through that portal, but we're chilling. And there's a fortress right here. Oh man, we are living life. Why do I need maniulium to mine nether iron? Oh, and there's literally cobalt right here, and I can't mine it because I don't know how to use the obsidian thing. Oh, I need a tool forge to use the obsidian thing. Oh. This thing says that it needs electrical steel blocks but then the tooltip says it can be any four metal blocks so we're going to use copper because i have a lot and tool forge now i should be able to use my obsidian upgrade kit do i need a flint oh fortified with obsidian and now i can mine with obsidian oh nice all right let's go get some cobalt now then what is that what is this oh can't mine it either great <laughs> Oh, ooh, 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 I did nothing. I literally did nothing to you. Why are you mad? Okay, time to leave. I got five. That's enough for a pickaxe, maybe. Oh, please let me through the portal. Oh, I made it. Oh, my God. Okay, never going back in there. Hmm. Looks like this is where I'm stopping my progression because I did not see any Ardite, and I'm not making Maniulium today. We will stop at Cobalt. Oh, this is Ardite. Oh. So that's what that was. Maybe I will do Maniulium today. Oh god, don't kill me. Okay. I think they do not like me mining Ardite or uh, Cobalt. So that's good to know. Um, I'm now stuck here. Why do you need Nether Gold? Like, why do you need Maniulium to mine Nether Gold? That doesn't make any sense. Well, why is there a Blaze here? I probably should kill that, though. Oh, I got a blaze rod, too. Oh, yep. Okay, we're leaving. I've overstayed my welcome, and the mobs know that. Let's make this maniulium.
five. I have five ingots of manuulium. That's enough for like a pickaxe head and maybe a sword head, and that's it. Oh, well, that, whatever. I'm only gonna make the pickaxe head though. I'm gonna have to use like steel or osmium or something else that I have for the other parts because I don't have enough manuulium. Oh, I have to make a sharpening kit for the quest? Oh, rats. Got quest done, but there's zombies everywhere. Oh. Okay, so the next level of gear is Osmo glass, Os Osglo glass. And it looks to be made from mechanism. Can I do this? Refined glowstone, refined obsidian, and osmium. Refined obsidian, I believe you need a mechanism thing for. Maybe? Yeah. Yeah, we need the, uh, the metallurgic infuser, I believe. There's probably a couple of other ways to get this, but this is... Uh, Basically, not gonna happen today. Use dragon bone for the handle because it's got uh, 130 durability. I think I'm gonna do that. Oh, okay, so osmium. So osmium gives dense, which is uh, more durability basically, and then additional XP. So I'm gonna do osmium handle, manuulium head, and then dragon bone uh, handle. All right, let's do this. Got the whole episode building up to making the most epic pickaxe at the manuulium mining level. We can't go any higher than that. Shh. Load up here. Tool station. Pickaxe head. Manuulium. So we get the good mining level and 800 durability. Osmium binding. So we get the dense and well-established modifiers. Gotta love a little bit of extra XP and more durability. And dragon bone tool rod, which will, I believe, give us some nice damage if we need to use this for any attacking. There we go. There's our nice pickaxe. Manuulium mining level. 12.7 attack. Jeez, that does more than my hammer, I think. Seven mining speed. There we go. Boom. Now I also need to modify this, so I think I need to make a modification table, or maybe it actually works in the... Where did I put it? Right here. Tool forge. Yeah, I think the tool forge is where you modify things. I'm going to throw on one of my four diamonds on here to increase the durability. Now let me see if this is actually worth doing. Yeah, that's, that's pretty good. It gives you up to... Was that 500 extra durability? Do I do that or do I wait? You know what, I'm gonna wait on that because I don't have a lot of diamonds, but hey, this is a very good pickaxe, especially for our stage in the game. All right, so with that, I think that'll be it for this episode. We got our really nice pickaxe out of the way and which means we can mine a lot of resources very quickly because we are going to need them. So I think I'm going to do a little bit of setup in between episodes here, maybe just clean up the base, build a nice little house or something. I don't really know, but I think Next episode, we're also probably going to go after one of these three. Maybe just get a start on one of them. Maybe industrial craft. So if we go into here, there looks like there's some pretty neat stuff in here. Like we can get a electric jetpack maybe, and then some of these other nice machines that would be nice. And I would like to start with mechanism, but we'd have to get through immersive engineering. Maybe we should do immersive engineering. I don't know. Well, we're going to do one of them. Oh, wait. Okay, Coke oven. This is for immersive engineering. I'm pretty sure this is important. I saw this somewhere. Do not remember where. Fairly certain this is important. So I think we're going to go after immersive engineering next time. That'll be all for today, though. Goodbye. Goodbye.